Today I want to talk a little bit about 360 degree photography. Uh, we've been talking about this for about a year now in the e-learning industry and while it hasn't uh, shown up in a lot of products, I think that this is something that's going to be coming real soon. And uh, I think we better start being prepared for it. 360 degree photography is very cool. Uh, it's a really neat technology. Um, unfortunately for for some of course it could be an expensive uh, proposition I'm just taking a look on amazon.com and of course uh, to get into some of these cameras it can be upwards to uh, $800 uh, $300 for an insta insta 361 uh, I've seen some other products in in and around that range I'm not sure what the quality is like of these devices that offer uh, you know, a 360 degree high resolution VR camera for $67.95. It would be very interesting to try those out and see how they stack up against maybe some of the better products. But really what I wanted to focus on today was, um, can you do this with the technology that you already have? So uh, in anticipation that we're going to start seeing this in e-learning technology in the not too distant future, I decided to do some preliminary experiments and you know looking at the equipment that I already have I've certainly got uh, a variety of tablets and smartphones that I can utilize so I did a little research and found out that there is actually a tool that would allow you to create what are called photospheres not true 360 degree photos but Using an application like Google Street View, you can record these photospheres where the application itself stitches together a bunch of your images that you've captured from either your iPad, your iPhone, or your Android device and stitch them together into a seamless 360 degree image. Depending on, of course, on the quality of your device, you may get better or less results. So um, I'm going to encourage everyone to perhaps share your experience with this. I think this is something that we should all probably uh, dip our toe in the uh, proverbial VR water, if you will, uh, and find out what, uh, what technology you have and how it works with this. So again, Google Street View is an application that's completely free. Uh, you can go out and capture either the 360 degree images from a spherical camera or you can create 360 degree photospheres yourself. Uh, and again, I was able to do that with my regular smartphone and uh, I also tried it with my, my iPad as well. And uh, both applications are available and I'll share some footage of this and some examples of what this looks like. Uh, again, I think with the, the stitched photos, there's probably going to be some flaws. Um, but, you know, I think for the most part, uh, you know, if you're just doing quick and dirty e-learning that includes 360 degree ph photography, how perfect does it need to be, especially if it's being delivered over the internet? Um, you could probably get away with uh, maybe a little lesser quality. Um, but, you know, again, everyone's needs are different. I'd be very interested to see what you guys think would be your use case scenario for such photography and e-learning. So go ahead and put your comments down in the comments below. I'd love to read them. And uh, if by all means, if you want to share some samples of your 360 degree photography, I'd love to look at those as well. If you thought this video was useful, please share it with your colleagues. If you need help with your next e-learning project, consider hiring me. My focus is to create effective e-learning that helps you achieve your business goals. Visit my website at CaptivateTeacher.com, follow me on Twitter at PaulWilsonLD, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.